Hello, this is Maddie, and today I'll be showing you how to submit to the Chrome Awards. So first things first, you're going to want to go to chromoawards.devpost.com. We'll have this linked on the website. You'll have to, this is kind of the submission portal, which allows us to manage all of these uh, different films, music videos, and games, and also uh, pay out the prizes as well. So what you're going to do is first register for the competition, and then you'll be brought to this main page where you can see all about the Chrome Awards, our different requirements, our different uh, community guidelines, the prizes as well. Uh, and of course, you can also find that on the website. So um, on chromoawards.com, we will have the different film, music video, and games requirements. So what we'd recommend is that you go through, you you know look up the category that you want to uh, submit to or compete in, and then you look at the different requirements because, for example, the for comedy and mockumentary, you'll probably be looking for a slightly different set of criteria versus marketing and advertising. Or, you know, for anime and anime action, we might be looking for a little bit of a different thing than a puzzle and strategy game. So make sure you're aware based on the category that you're uh, applying to. Going back to the dev post um, portal, uh, you know, let's see here. Uh, let's make our first submission. Um, so make sure that you, you know, have reviewed the rules, you're above uh, 18 years or older. And then um, for these uh, countries, unfortunately, we can't uh, support them because of uh, legal uh, and finance laws across the world where uh, you have to, uh, you know, there are just some, some restrictions for your hosting an online competition. Cool. Let's create our first project. So if you want to add your team members and they're also on dev post or uh, you can do that optionally, but you can also just skip that. I'm going to add a name for my project. Uh, I can add a log line or description. So, uh, you know, let's just say, um, I, I think, you know, something more descriptive, especially if you do one of these narrative pieces. So, uh, uh, you know, in a world where Etc. Cetera, Etc. Cetera. I'm just using that as an example for whatever description or or um, uh, of your project. Uh, you can do that here. You can add a thumbnail. The thumbnail isn't um, you know it's just for the the project gallery, uh, but you can add that if you'd like. Um, additionally, if you want to add about how you built it, this will be important for uh, some of the sponsor awards where we'll be looking at um, uh, who. Uh, you know, who for each tool uh, is that best representative of that company. You can find all of those different sponsor awards um, on our prizes page where um, we have our title sponsors, gold sponsors, silver sponsors, each with different uh, cash cash uh, prizes attached. So I'm just going to add something because you need to add something here, uh, but uh, you, you don't need to uh, fill out all of these different sections unless you want to. But uh, you know, I'm just going to do some test example for here. Uh, this is also not too important. If you want to put the, the tools you used, we'll have a different section on that on the next page for those different sponsor prizes. So if you want to put your tools here, or you could just put a placeholder, uh, cause it is, you know, the star means required. Um, similarly, this, the, this other stuff doesn't matter. The video demo link, um, this only accepts YouTube, Facebook, and Vimeo. So if you try to do Instagram or TikTok or Reddit, which we also accept for the competition, you'll get an error. So for example, uh, you know, any type of other uh, link, right? It's not gonna, it's not gonna work. So if I try to, uh, well, if I go to go to submit, it'll, uh, it'll give me this error. So I'm just gonna put a YouTube link for now, but you'll have a, a place for a uh, place for for that in the next section. Depending on the category, you want to choose your category within film, music, video, or games. You want to say, yes, you agree to the terms and services, and you follow the rules, and your project was made after February 1st, 2025. We have a, the competition is two months, but we also have a, a allow submissions from the past couple months too, because people have busy lives. Um, and let's see, the hyperlink to the submission. So this is, if you want to put that, Vimeo, TikTok, Instagram, any any type of link you want to be able to view your submission online, um, that'll be right there. Uh, if you want to put your team, you know, buy Chrome Awards. Say I 
added my team number. This is the important part for those sponsor prizes. So uh, depending on which tool you used, you can add the different um, uh, you know, tools from our sponsors, um, et cetera, and it'll make you eligible for those prizes because we'll be able to see which uh, films used which tools. You can also opt into uh, distribution on a variety of platforms. And then uh, if you belong to, if you heard about uh, Chrome Awards from one of the following communities, they're also offering uh, additional prizes. So you can only select one so that, um, and then they'll, they'll also be verifying, uh, you know, if you're actually from that community, but that'll make you eligible. You can add your country. So I'll add USA, United States, I'll add San Francisco. You know, my thing was in English. But you can add, and all of these have, uh, you know, some of these are optional, some of these are required, but filling it out really helps us with information such as opening up which categories or which cities we run events in. So we'd recommend that you do it, but um, you know, no pressure. Uh, for university students, we'll have um, some additional prizes, um, but I'm not a student, so I'm not going to put that there. You know, I'm an intermediate level. Maybe I spent $100 in, in budget on the free trials. This really helps us out with the information of knowing the impact of, of the free trials we gave away and hopefully gets us to be able to provide more in future seasons. So I spent 40 hours about on the thing and I heard about it from social media. And then maybe I have a suggestion for, for next year. Great. Um, yeah, and then if you could submit on social media, if you could share your film on social media, mention the Chroma Awards, our accounts. Uh, we're just start starting out. This is a community effort. So your support and um, reshares of it really, really does help us out. And it gets us more uh, leverage. We're, we're, we're working with sponsors to be able to uh, have more brand presence and be able to facilitate cooler opportunities for you as the creator. And that's it. So, oh wait, well, almost additional info. Oh, yeah, so I needed to add the hyperlink to my submission. So this one is the required one. Okay, save and continue. Agree to the terms. And submit, there you go. So this is because it only show up here, uh, the video here, uh, if you um, if you put the if you put that link here, if you didn't put any link here, then uh, it will uh, not show up, but you're able to go in and edit this throughout the, the remainder of the, uh, the, the competition. You can make multiple submissions and you're able to, um, edit it, delete it, add more until that November 3rd, uh, submission deadline. So that's a little overview of the submission process using dev post. Um, and I hope it's not too complicated. Thank you.